serious music to start off with. Fair enough. All right, everyone, welcome back to another Black Ops 3 Custom Zone maps. And today we're playing, um, I can't believe it. It's called Minecraft, not Minecraft, Minecraft. Just breathe that in for a second. Let that, let that sink in. Minecraft. Yeah, I know. I even heard the name. I was like, oh my God, you've got to be kidding me. Of course it's called Minecraft. Oh, this is not a bad gun to actually have at the very start. Uh, how much does it do escape? 1,300. I'm not sure if this map actually has an Easter egg, but I know it has a Bible ending, and that's all I really know. There wasn't really much in the description of the map. Not much at all to go on, so this is more of a surprise for me. All right, let's escape this place and have a look at the vast wilderness. The music still just feels so out of place. Okay, there's a workbench over there, so we need to get some shield parts to actually get that. And it looks like to be an ender dragon egg. Is there a reason I can't get in? It does look like that could be a soul box, maybe? The first things first, I want to get this up here. Give me some quick revive. Give me a hundred bucks first. Let's get this, and let's see if this actually is a soul box. No, it's not. Oh, death machine. Uh, zombies, 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 where are you? I hear him. But where's a good question? So mystery box. Oh shit, mystery box is all the way over there. Wow. Okay. Oh, there's a shield part. See, that wasn't too hard to find. I do like how there's an actual sculpture dragon on top there. So how do I get into there? I want Widow's wine. All right, that's all right. I'll leave one zombie this round. <gasps> oh, he hit me down really fast. Maybe I should have actually moved out of the way, people. That was my bad. I'm still just came home from work. I'm still very exhausted. I don't think my life is kind of calmed down just yet, but you know, I still want to make videos. And prefer, um, you know, English. English is not very working after a long day of work. Um, I am actually going to start in the next video my playthrough of Remnant from the Ashes 2. If you guys are very interested in watching it, then stay tuned for it. If you don't want to watch it, then that's fine. I'm still going to do zombie videos for you guys to enjoy. But I just want something chill, something fun. Maybe you guys can actually join me. If you guys actually want to see me stream it, then go right ahead. I'm chucking it right down in the comment section. I'll see if I can actually try it. Now, let's see where can we actually go. 1,200 to go in here. That's good. And we can actually go all the way to the back over here. Yeah, so that's just a shield. So it circles all the way around and through here. There's barbed wire there too. I don't have much ammo left actually. No, I just realized it. I need some type of gun. See, the mini Uzi will work out pretty fine. Aha! Clear the breeze right there. That's easy. Wait, 2,440. It's such a specific number. All right, I've got enough points. Let's see if we can actually go through to the next area. Clear the breeze. Not what I expected at all. Oh, this is cool, though. I'm liking this. I still haven't found power yet. Mmm. That is interesting. Oh, God, that's uh, very dark down here. What's this weapon? An MP5. Oh, I'll keep the weapons I have at the moment. Mystery box shouldn't be too far away. So let's climb up here. Let's see what we can gather from here. That's an AK-47 right there. I'm getting the AK-47. Always. Get 100 points from double points. And there seems to be a bunch of blocks in there. Plus a teddy bear. Collect all the teddy bears. I do hope that... 
3,500 to clear the bruise. I really do hope that um, those teddy bears don't actually create songs because I don't want music playing. Hey, mystery box, there it is. Well, it's a good thing that I actually um, kept my money now, isn't it? I can get it twice. Give me AK. Oh my god, the saw? Yeah, no, <laughs> no rockets. This sounds so nice. All right, where to now? Uh, is this uh, clear the breeze well? 1,500, there's so many areas to explore. You know what? I like this map so far. I do like how there's got a lot of rooms involved here. I don't understand why I need to clear the breeze for just a couple of blocks. I can just climb over that. I was expecting this map to be actually be pretty short. I'm actually glad it isn't. Well, 4,000 points is pretty easy. I know I can go for the mystery block and get another good weapon, but you know. Who can say no to this? The AK-47. Still a great... Um... There's just someone, you know, doing a ritual for a banana. Let's kill some zombies around the banana and see if it actually is a soul box. If it actually is a soul box, then Jesus Christ. This is a meme craft, not a Minecraft, not a Minecraft. Oh, too many words. It is a soul box. Well, I am I'm glad that I actually waited this out. Oh. Come on, zombies. Do not have all day. Let's just... And that banana is getting huge now. Oh, this sword did take forever to actually reload, though. Come on, zombies, you can do it. What's the reach of this? Yep, the reach of it is pretty good. Ready, and... Oh. Ah, there we go. That's good. I do not want that for obvious reasons. So let's just continue through here. 3,500, and it's a maze. No, I have to find Pack-A-Punch parts too. That's going to take forever, actually. Let's go through all this to see if we can find some parts. The zombies are too slow to actually act at the moment. Oh god. Oh god, yeah. There's this tripping. Oh, there's Jug. I know where I'm going. Oh, there it is. I'm pretty sure all the pack a punch parts are in this maze. That was electric cherry. There's another 100 points right there. That's good. And anything over here. Now, so I've gotten two pack a punch parts so far. The actual mainframe part and the flag. Um, okay, so we made it out of the maze. That was, that's, that's piss fart easy. I have to go back in there. How do I get into there? Right there seems mischievous. How big is this place? I have to find power parts too. God, this game is just so... Oh, wait a minute. Please don't tell me that's another... Yeah, that's, that's another... Um, soul box thing. 3,000 to go through there. Okay. There's still another way over here that I can go. This map is pretty huge, though. 1,500. Perfect. Oh, shield part. Oh, brilliant. Oh, there's power. Okay, well... Okay, well, how do I... Oh, God, I've got to find the rest of the power parts then. Okay, I've got 8,000 points. That's a good enough amount of points to keep going now. Considering I probably should have Muzi over now because I've already spent a lot of time. How does one transfer through this maze without getting lost? That's actually really easy. Now, if I go down to the very bottom here... Through these doors. Oh, this is trippy. It's a long corridor of death. 
Hello, zombies. Yeah, it seems like I'm back outside. It seems I'm in the cornfield. I'm outside here now. This is interesting. Okay, well, let's explore the cornfields and see what I can find. Oh, I found the watermelon. No, I didn't want to kaboom. Clear the breeze for a thousand? What the breeze? Ah. Ah, okay. But where is the last um power? Oh, that's that's pack a punch, isn't it? There's pack a punch. Okay, this watermelon needs to get done right now. Oh, <gasps> and I got jug. Yeah, that's perfect. Now, the only problem with this is, um, where the hell is that last uh, power part? Craft zombie shield. Okay, I'm not staying down here for too long. I'm going to get trapped. Oh my god, I found the last piece. It was the wire. I can't believe that took me so long to find that. That hurts so much. And now that I've actually got power back on, I can finally do what I was supposed to do at the very start. And that is to go up to the very top of here. And I believe that this door over here should be open. Yep. And look what I can finally do. A pineapple. That's all I needed to do. It just hurts. This probably won't take too long anyway. These fruits haven't required me to do much at all. With 69 bullets, I will do this. A magic door has opened. And let me guess what the magic door is. It's the ender dragon egg. <laughs> That's a really creepy sound. Hey, look, it's the ender dragon. I never knew that. Just sitting at the top there. Oh, hello. That wasn't it. Hmm, instead of magic doors opened. Oh, dude, how did I miss that? How did I miss pack a punch at the back here? Oh, wire. I'll take that. Let's back a punch this as well. Perfect. Now I got two back a punch weapons. But dude, where is this? Where is this um secret room? It's talking about. Hmm. Now look at that. Another teddy. You don't reckon that you need to get all the teddies to go in there, do you? Oh my god, I found it. I found it. Please let that be the last teddy bear. Yes, people. It was. End the game, 80,000.
We need 80,000 points to end the game. Oh, that is so much. All right, people. We'll do what we always do. We'll skip straight past it all. But first of all, where is the zombie? All right, people, what I'll do for you guys, like I always do, is I will actually just skip to the very end part of me getting 80,000. Because right now, all I'm going to be doing is grinding the points out. And of course, I just wanted to show you guys what the map looked like and how to get all the Easter eggs to the map. Like, there was just three teddy bears you had to shoot. Oh, was it four? I think there was four teddy bears you had to shoot. There was also a bunch of parts around the map for shield, pack-a-punch, and power. All of it wasn't too hard. It was more fact that the, um, that last teddy bear shits me to my core. All right, I'll see you guys at the end of the video. All right, people, I'm at the 66,000 part. I still need 14,000, but I thought I might as well take this um, end part of the video to actually talk to you guys about something, you know, very important. Not very important. But like I said at the start of the video, I am going to be doing my Roman from the Ashes 2 um, playthrough again. Like I said, I do want to do playthroughs again just for the fact that I've got something continuously to upload. And I've got so many games I want to play, but I focus too much on Black Ops. And I don't have enough time to play it. So I was thinking, why don't I actually just make videos of, you know, playthroughs again like I used to. Like I did that at my start of my channel. It was fun. I enjoyed it a lot, and that's the whole point of YouTube, isn't it? It's just to actually upload what you enjoy. If people like it, they like it. If they don't, well, I respect your choices. If there's something you don't like, then of course, you don't have to like it. But I, like I said, I'll still be doing the Black Ops 3 zombie video. So everyone who's actually come to this channel just to watch Black Ops Zombies, there is always going to be something for you. Don't get me wrong, like I always will come back to this. There's always great content to have in this game, but you gotta admit, where I stand right now when it comes to zombie, um, zombie videos, it is a hard industry to actually, you know, continue. So many people want to do zombies nowadays, it's hard for me to even get started. One more round, oh, round 23, and I need 1,300. Great. There is so many zombie content, but it's like this. There's already so much that's been done and overused. There's not really much else for me to actually show. Can you imagine if I did zombie videos like three or four years ago and I was just showing like the slender maps and all that? Oh, mate, that would have been hyped videos. Go on, almost done. But I think doing gameplays and stuff like that, you know, will kind of bring in a new audience of people. Audience of people. We'll bring in a new audience. All right, this is it. And here we are, 80,000, and this is how we end it. With a nuke and end the game. Thank you very much. That was a great map. I did enjoy it. The only thing that shit me was the placement of those teddy bears. The one at the very end on the top of the building. Mmm. Annoyed me. Either way, guys, in my next video, I'll be starting the Remnant 2 gameplay so if you guys are interested please stay tuned if not i will have black ops zombie videos ready for you next time too all right guys if you did enjoy the video please leave a like or comment down below if you guys want to see more videos like this and subscribe to further support the channel see you next time guys